Here is another episode of these pocket size podcasts to help you get a better broadcast podcast and voice over voice. Hello, I'm Peter Stewart and uh, on Twitter, Twitter Stewart, follow me there. Uh, leave a review if you would on your favourite podcast app. Breathing and reading and intonation and all sorts of stuff we've been talking about over the, ha- the past, what, more than 900 episodes now with daily advice and anecdotes and help from a career either side of the mic helping you use your mouth better talking of which we're talking about symptoms and prescriptions to help you get a better broadcast podcast and voice over voice yesterday it was boring reading today what do you do if you have a dry mouth you're unable to move your tongue around properly to form words leading to poor articulation and possibly some mistakes as well well here is my prescription today learn to breathe in more through your nose because that moistens and filters the air for you it's obviously usually less possible when you're actually talking what we tend to do then is take snatches of air through our mouth between our thoughts and the mouth may be dry in the first place because mouth breathing has become a habit More on what we know about the nose in episode 63, incidentally. And here's another tip. Drink plenty of water. Yeah, hydrate, mate. Uh, For several days before a speaking event, whether it's on stage or on mic, to give you systemic hydration for your whole body and then keep topping up on the day to keep your mouth and larynx wet, which is topical hydration. Um, I say keep your larynx wet. I mean, as we've looked at several times before, nothing that you chew, nothing you eat, nothing you swallow actually touches your larynx. But by topping up your water intake, it will make the outside of your vocal folds uh, wetter, more slippery, much mucus around there which will help you talk better as well but also in your mouth as well you, across your teeks across your cheeks uh, in your gums and your tongue especially some people say apple juice works wonders others suggest running the tip of your tongue deep along the trench between your cheek and your teeth top and bottom hold on oh, oh, oh could just work a series of episodes from number 750 which i entitled the hydration situation will see you right by the way when you drink too much water your kidneys can't get rid of the excess and the sodium content of your blood becomes dilated this can be life-threatening hyponatremia is what it's called you won't go there will you you'll just be sensible in the amount of water you drink deal deal Okay, tomorrow, dealing with Marilyn Monroe as Get A Better Broadcast podcast and voiceover voice continues. From London, I'm Peter Stewart.